Hey guys, it's Ryan here and welcome to episode number 6 of the F1 2013 Overtakes of the Week where you guys have been sending in your submissions from the PS3, Xbox 360 and PC Steam platforms and let's kick this episode off where we always start with number 5 with a classic overtake in a 1999 Ferrari at Suzuka from F1R Phone F and he's coming towards Turn 1 now on the main straight He's, remember, there's no Kurz or DRS because it is a classic car. Going into Turn 1, he's side-by-side side with Waldy. Still side-by-side side going around Turn 1. They're keeping the, giving the space there so he can get back down the inside Waldy there. But f one is going to not have any of it. He loses the position back, but the track's controlling that Ferrari. Gets the speed and goes back around the outside to complete the move. Fantastic move there and gets number 5. Number 4, we have Son of Moore. And he is on the PC and he's in Hungary in his Red Bull. Just come up the pit lane there and is down to fourth place. And he's going to be wanting to get into those, that podium position to help him win, to get some big result in this race. He's come now to start at the middle sector. Sees the force in the other prime tyre, so he's going to get better traction out of this corner. He's going to come out towards a corner where he can't really overtake. Takes that inside line nicely and gets the move done there for number four. Number three, we have Max Shepard again on the PC. This time he's in Singapore. Sees the Lotus hit the wall there and they're now going to be side by side going to the next corner. And he's going to do it round the outside of the Lotus. A brilliant move there from Mac and gets number three. The runner up is fair play. And I've got to say this is impressive because he's on a keyboard for this. And he's in Monza in the Ferrari coming out towards the chicane now. You can hear the clicks there. That is him pressing his keyboard. Pressing the right and left arrows there to get his overtake done here. Got a break now, got to go on the outside of the Lotus, similar to what Alonso did to Mark Webber, what he did on Mark Webber in the 2013 season round in Monza. A fantastic move there from Fair Play, and he is the runner-up on this episode of Overtakes of the Week, so you've got to give Fair Play to Fair Play for that overtake there. But the winner, Christian Nenoff, with what I believe is something stunning, in the wet, at Monaco, no assists. Let's see how he does here. He's coming out towards the hairpin, the slowest corner in Formula 1. He's going to go down the inside of the Lotus and they're not even touching each other. And he goes down that inside and does the move and keeps it nicely. And he is the winner of episode 6 of the F1 2013 Overtakes of the Week. But if you think you can do better than that, send your submissions to Overtakes of the Week F1 at Hotmail.com. And remember, it's got to be online only, either sprint mode or a custom Grand Prix mode. And remember, like you saw in number five, in uh, submission number five, classic content is allowed on current tracks, vice versa. And always, always guys, to remember to like and favorite the video. Our target today, once again, is 80 likes on this video. And hopefully, next time by or the one after, a guest appearance will return. I can wonder what we'll be revealing who it is until the episode comes out. But until next time, guys, next week, wherever you want to have a great day, I shall see you then.